putting impact tape, its whole purpose in life is to tell you where you make contact with the ball on the face of your putter. I want you to tap, tap, tap your putter with some sharp item, a tee, a key, anything that will show you when you hit it solid, the putter doesn't turn. If you hit it on the toe, it rotates. If you hit it on the heel, it rotates. If you hit it right on the sweet spot, find out if your putter is marked for, correctly for your sweet spot. Then take the center line of this impact pattern and put it right where your sweet spot is. Mine is right there. Right there. On this putter, it's right in the center of the boxes. Okay, this is a smart square putter. I'm trying to hit the ball right in the center of those boxes. It's the same size as the boxes, so I just put them all in a line. Okay, now, look, every time your putter makes contact with the ball, it's going to make a mark. And three-foot putts will make little marks. Ten-foot putts, thirty-foot putts will make big marks. And if your pattern is all over the putter face like this, that means you need to practice with putting clips. You need the clips to train yourself to hit the ball sweet spot of the putter. If your pattern is tight like this, you're good to go. You don't need putting clips. You just need to practice putting and groove your touch because if you hit the ball in the sweet spot of your putter, that means you're transferring the right amount of energy to the putt, you're going to be making some putts. If you just practice enough, get your pattern tight enough, your touch will get better, you'll make more putts, and you'll love this game.